Loved it, absolutely loved it. I've loved the ability to just literally roll out of bed, walk downstairs in my pajamas some days and just start working. And just having everything at your fingertips set up. You can work early in the morning, late in the evenings. You can, it's so flexible. And it's actually been really productive. Absolutely loved it. As long as you keep away from the fridge, that's a, that's a rule. Yeah. <laughs> that's, a that's true too. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's been great in showing other people who aren't so much used to working remotely that it can be done and we can still deliver the work to clients. We've literally still been able to help them during, especially in PA during a really busy time. It's a new way of doing things. You know, most of our clients are going through similar challenges as what we are and so it's we've had a lot of common ground in terms of being able to support them and really understanding and um, you know, demonstrating empathy towards their situation. I think, um, I think from my perspective in PA, so much of the work with clients has really been future focused as opposed to looking in the past and you know, really helping clients prepare for the, you know, the new normal in, in six to 12 months time. Their biggest challenge is really preserving their cash and how do they do that by maintaining revenue, managing their people costs, stock and suppliers, as well as occupancy costs. And being in audit, we are at the forefront of our clients um, and they really do look to us, you know, to be a sounding board, um, to gain insights and help them navigate through the complexities and the challenges that they face during these times. uncertainty and and I guess stability back in the market is, is quite important and from a company's perspective the best thing they can really do is just forward plan cash is king so um, you know Grant Thornton has that resilience wheel up on up on our website which is a really good tool for companies to use to, to critically think about their business and the risks and, and the issues and and then any number of, of experts and can navigate it from there. We've coined the term business development with purpose, um, webinars um, and other interactive sessions where you have an agenda rather than, you know, kind of general coffees. Um, so I think, I think that will probably remain even once we go back to the normal world. If anyone would have told us what we would have come up against six months ago, I don't think we would have believed it. Um, but here we are, we're still, you know, uh, getting, getting things done for our clients and working together and uh, having good times.